clouds. I love clouds. I know that you do too. They are magical, fluffy and amazing. But have you noticed that clouds have one big flaw? You can't just take a photo of them and easily use it as a part of your digital masterpiece. Of course, unless the very photo you have taken is a masterpiece. Cleaning the background is a nightmare. Luckily, there is a solution. Recently, we have published our first cloud kit. It is ideal for 3D artists, concept artists, photographers, illustrators and video artists. The package contains 19 phases of cloud development or 19 different clouds. All in all, there are more than 200 PNG images and 19 VTB objects available for you to play with. If you are a concept artist or an illustrator working in 2D and 3D software, you probably won't need clouds in a 3D format. But if you are looking for ultimate control, then the VDB pack is the right solution for you. Now, what can you do with this cloud kit? Obviously, in programs like Photoshop, GIMP or Affinity Photo, you can do wonders with the render passes. You can use those same passes in a 3D environment as well. I do it in Blender. This gives you a lot more flexibility. You can use 3D planes as image cards by applying cloud textures to them. You can even go a step further and set your cloud card to react to any light source, just the way a 3D object with a volume would. I might do a separate tutorial on this topic, so please let me know what you think. Inside the package you will find key light passes from different angles. Although they are named key lights, some of them are actually rim lights and backlights. This means that the same cloud can be used as many different ones. Some of you need even more control. You might want to increase resolution, adjust the color, density, rotation and camera angle. This is when the VDB format comes in handy. Be aware that you won't be able to work with VDBs on a crappy computer. I am using 1080 Ti graphics card, but I would recommend that you use a stronger one, if possible. So anyway, I hope you'll enjoy using our cloud kit. Of course, you don't have to use it for clouds only. You can create fog, nebulous or even cotton candy. Look, Look at, this at this pink cotton, cotton candy, candy cloud. cloud. Do whatever you want. Don't limit yourself. You're the artist. 